I think you'd better listen to me for a moment, Baron, so that I may put the position very clearly. Our government insists that there shall be no misunderstanding. Neither the British nor the French want trouble. They have already agreed privately with Ehrenthal to recognize the annexation before the conference. Oh, those are tales from the Vienna woods, my friend. Aaron Tom will tell you anything to bring off this little coup without a bite. But, even if it were true, the British and the French would have no option but to support us if we go to war. But you won't. I happen to know that you have already decided that Russia is in no position to fight. Oh, we shall support the Serbs. And if there's any doubt in Berlin on that score, you may dispel it at once. You will not support the Serbs. You will withdraw your support and bring pressure on them to recognize the annexation. Are you threatening us? No, Baron. I'm threatening you. Unless you do as we ask, we shall see to it that the secret negotiations between you and Erenthal are made public. <laughs> Negotiations? What negotiations? Well, there are letters and records of talks. Ehrenthal informs us that he has a document in your own handwriting, stating quite clearly your agreement to recognize the annexation. Under certain conditions, but those conditions were never fulfilled. Well, the document doesn't make that clear. What is clear to us in Berlin is that you agreed to give away British and French interests without consulting them. Do you know what he has done to diplomacy? Do you think anyone will ever trust anyone anymore? What is certain, Baron, is that no one will ever trust you anymore. Well, I'll take that risk. I think I can explain myself to Britain and France. And can you explain yourself to the Serbs? Hmm? Can you explain to them how you bartered away their rights to compensation in a secret deal and for your own advantage? And even worse, can you explain it to your own government, who are blithely demanding compensation at this moment, totally unaware that they have already sacrificed Serbia's right to it? You will do as you are told. 